find me yellow demon always creeping on the avenue Call like hello screaming in the mic like what the fuck is new I'm that jello needing window peeping kid who spit the truth Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's Jacoby. Long time no see, I think, maybe. I don't know. I've been really busy, obviously, because I am... I don't know why I'm yelling. I am moving in, literally, tomorrow to my dorm, and I'm starting volleyball season, so you already know. Y'all already know how that goes. Very busy schedule. But here we are. We are vlogging. This is my last day at home. Um, Today, I have so much to do. So right now, it is... 7.49 in the morning. I am here at this little park track thingy to get a run in. It should be interesting. Okay, anyways, let's go run. Okay, so I'm back from my run. It actually wasn't that bad at all. Like, I feel like, I mean, like, I could literally practice right now and be fine. So, now I think I'm going to go to, like, Publix or something because I really want to get, um, like, a muscle milkshake. You know how, like, people drink those all the time? I really want to try one of those. Okay, um, sorry this, like, whole vlog is in my car, but I promise... We will be getting to it. I got a core power. I'm going to say core power instead of muscle milk. I don't know why I said that. But I just got a refrigerated, a single refrigerated one. And it was $2.71 with tax. So I got this um, core power. Oh, it's fueled by Fairlife. Mm. Okay, anyways. Uh, core power, high protein milkshake, chocolate. I got chocolate. Um, I feel like you can't really mess up chocolate. Vanilla now can taste a little protein-y in my opinion so we're just gonna give it a little taste sorry the sun actually is like so wishy-washy okay i moved now we're better kind of okay turn my air down so y'all can hear me let's taste test this so let's give this a, a shake here because you know let's see the nutrition facts it says it's uh per serving or per bottle it's 170 calories 4.5 grams of fat um 260 milligrams of sodium 8 grams of carbs, uh, 5 grams of sugar. Okay, that's not bad. 26 grams of protein. That's really good. It has 25% vitamin D, calcium, iron. Oh, it's iron in it? I'm iron deficient. Oh, I might buy these if it tastes good. It smells like nothing. That is amazing. That is so good. <laughs> that is so good. Oh my god. I might have to buy these. These are so good. I literally just taste like chocolate milk. All right, I'm sold. Those are freaking good. I have to buy those in bulk or something on Amazon. Keep them in my in my mini fridge in my dorm and get freaking swole. But anyways, now we're about to go home. And what time is it? It is like 8:30. Okay, it's 8:35. I have a dentist appointment at 11, so we're gonna go home, shower, finish my shake, and then we're gonna start packing. So I'm gonna show you all some of the dorm stuff I'm bringing because, uh, or not my dorm stuff. I'm gonna show you my volleyball stuff. And if you want to see my dorm stuff, go to my vlog channel. Period. Okay, so I'm going to show you the stuff that I'm bringing for my move-in tomorrow because I don't have, like, the gear that my school is going to give me yet, so I'm just going to bring my stuff, obviously. So I'm going to bring one pair of black knee pads, these Nike ones that I have had for, like, ever. These are an extra small, small, I believe, or I think. I actually don't know. I think that's what they are, but yeah these and then since i'm like weird i'm gonna bring a white pair of knee pads just to be prepared because you know you never know like a lot of people might be wearing white or black so if more if more people are wearing white i rather wear white and then vice versa so these adidas ones are really nice i like them a lot but i like the nike ones better personally um and then i'm also bringing my shoe in inserts in soles whatever you call them um i just have like i don't have bad feet i just like to protect my feet and be as comfortable as i can in my shoe so i usually use slip these in into my shoes and they help with my arch support and they're just really comfortable and they help me not hurt as bad so yeah these were given to me by my trainer at southern miss so i don't know where you could buy these because i didn't pay for them but anyways these really help me so shoe inserts um then i'm gonna be bringing okay sorry everything's like connected <laughs> i'm bringing an ankle brace i don't have a second ankle brace this black dawn joy ankle brace and it like laces up in the front it has all the velcro stuff that wraps around you know you know the deal um next i'm gonna bring these armbands um i don't really know if i'm gonna actually wear these or not i don't i'm just gonna bring them 
but they're like little armbands that slip onto your platform and they make the ball come off really clean you they're kind of big for me because my wrists are literally petite like childlike but so you slide them up to where you want to hit the ball so um like i've been saying in like all my passing videos you don't want to contact the ball right here like on the bottom of your your hand i guess but if these would actually fit me right they would be about right here and because you want to contact the ball right here in the middle so it'd be like this and the ball will come off boop hit the sweatband whatever you want to call it and it'll, the ball will come off so clean and it'll basically take the spin away from the ball so i like wearing these sometimes if i need them if i need to better my passing <laughs> um and lastly we are bringing oh my eye shoes of course um, and also i say this in like every volleyball video i feel but like i wear the lebron 15 lows and everything that i just showed you will be in the description except for the armbands because i actually i don't know if i put these in the description or not just check because everything that i like or my volleyball essentials are in the description so if you have any questions or you want to look for yourself it's all in the description except for the shoe inserts i don't know where these were from so but yeah these are my lebron 15 lows my babies my favorite shoes ever they're so comfortable and they just you know they're just my children they do me well so i'm bringing those and then if i could find the other sock i can't but i'm also going to bring these elite socks I've, I've showed these before in a video as well i'm going to bring these little short like mid height elite socks and i just like these because they're not too flashy but they're thick on the bottom they have like ribbing so they're just really good for like impact sports so yeah that's what i'm bringing put it all back so i don't forget it but yes that's Part of my packing stuff now i'm gonna shower and then if i'll show y'all a little sneak a little sneak peek of what i'm bringing for my door yes and also if you're wondering where this bag is from it is like this lululemon bag okay anyways i'm gonna get showered and i'll catch up with you later when i am ready okay so here's some of the dorm stuff i bought a mirror to hang over my door i got that from bed bath and beyond and then i got a shower caddy and then I also got like a delicate wash bag. Oh, Jesus. I got a delicate wash bag to wash my, my underwear and stuff in because the dorm washing machines are really rough. So, and then right there is all my school supplies, but I'm going to show you all that in my what's in my backpack video on my vlog channel. All right, this is what I have so far Crocs, Air Force Ones, fancy shoes that I might need. White Air Force Ones, slides, two pairs of tennis shoes, one Adidas, one Nike. And then I have all my volleyball stuff, school stuff, and all my summer clothes in there. And my bedding. And over there is my drying rack. So here's my backpack. I have the North Face, like Boreas, Borealis, whatever, backpack. So, yes. All right, hey, you guys. Okay, so I have a really bad list now because I got my tooth fixed. I'm going to give you a list of everything that i'm packing please ignore my list i'm so sorry can you all understand me so what i suggest to bring to college for volleyball this is not like a dorm list or like something that's like oh like bring sheets or like a shower caddy like no this is for volleyball in specific specific i'm dead i literally can't feel this <laughs> okay first of all i would suggest bringing two pairs of knee pads one white one black if you if you only have one pair that's fine just bring knee pads because you never know and also i know that you will receive stuff when you get there but you always want to have your own stuff because in the beginning and preseason, you'll be practicing usually in your own gear until they give you whatever they give you so keep that in mind bring knee pads next you want to bring some ankle braces if you wear them. Um, if you don't, that's okay. I suggest you do, especially if you jump a lot or you hit a lot. But bring ankle braces because, once again, you're not going to have your gear right when you get there, usually. So bring ankle braces and bring two of them. Next, if you have any kind of inserts like I do, bring those. Um, arm sleeves, arm bands, head bands, pack those. Because literally, like, you can, like, forget, like, the smallest thing. But, like, the smallest thing can make such a big impact. So, on top of, like, the headbands and stuff, pack, like, a scrunchie. Pack, like, three. 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 
pack three to five scrunchies or like a hair tie or whatever because guaranteed you will lose one or someone's gonna need an extra and then that one's gone so make sure just to pack extra hair ties extra hair ties I sound ridiculous, like when I'm editing this, I'm gonna be like, bruh. But make sure to bring hair ties. Um, next I would say is pack all the spandex you have. Like, I pack at least, I think, eight, nine pairs of spandex. Because trust me, you're gonna run through those so fast, and you don't wanna have to do laundry every day, especially if you um, have to pay for it, like I do. So, pack spandex, okay? You need that. You need that. Next, um, pack as many sports bras as you can. I say that because you will also run through those super fast. Because, like, on top of practice, you could be working out or something like that, and you need a sports bra for that. And you wanna bring, like, and you wanna have, like, a couple because you don't want to, like, once again, do laundry every day. So, sports bras. Um, next I would say is your, obviously, your valuable shoes. Don't forget those. You, that's, like, the most important thing. Don't forget your shoes, at least, at minimum. Don't forget your shoes. Because those, you actually, like, they're already broken in, and you play in them. So don't freaking forget those. Forget those. My mouth hurts. Anywho, that's my collective volleyball packing list. Everything, like, the basics, the bare minimum of what you need when you're moving into your dorm, your apartment, whatever. But... Y'all see my lips? I'm like, oh, because <laughs> it's numb. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. I will see you guys next freaking week. And I'll be on campus again. So get ready for what? Get ready for vlogs and all that good stuff. Anyways, peace the freak out. Also, I post a lot on my vlog channel, so if you want to go check that out, it's called Jacoby. It's also linked in the description, so go check that out. Anyways, goodbye. See you guys later. Peace. Woke up at 11 o'clock, I ain't got no job, what the hell should I do today? This feel like some mile, I don't give a fuck, oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say. What the deal, how you feel, not important, all I'm thinking about is...